two sample t test in SPSS. So in this question which I have, I'm testing a two sample t test using a, a data corrected from a certain researcher who was testing two um, two brands of fertilizers and how effective they are into the plant growth. So I want to check if there are difference or significant difference in applying fertilizer brand one or brand two. So what you need to do in order to perform a two sample t test is just clicking the option analyze then moving to where we have compare mean then coming to where we have a dependent sample t test then you will input the fertilizer brand as your group variable and the test variable is the height of the plant then you you define the values of those group variable so the values I inputted as brand 1 of fertilizer I give it value 1 and brand 2 of fertilizer I give it value 2 then I click continue then after that you will click ok and then and the and the data will be here of comparing the mean so what we we focus most with is the if the, is there any difference between the mean let us check the mean of brand one of fertilizer was 53.0714 and the mean of brand two fertilizer was 54.25 uh, 54.25 so this is not a very significant difference between the mean you can check you another thing which you want to check in order to know if you shall adopt an R hypothesis or an alternative hypothesis. So in two sample t test we adopt a NAR hypothesis if there is no difference between the mean of the two samples and we, we adopt an alternative hypothesis if there is a significant difference between the mean of the two samples so another thing which we can check is the upper is the lower and the upper tail of the of our data so you can check and see that if there if there exists a zero between an upper if between the lower and the upper case of our data we adapt a NAR hypothesis but if here we have both positive or both negative the upper case is negative and the lower case is negative we will also adapt an alternative hypothesis but if there is a negative and a positive in the upper case and there is zero here between we adapt an NAR, a NAR hypothesis you can also another thing which we use to test is the significance you can see that we have 70 79 percent chance because this is 0 0.79 so multiply by 100 so we have 79 percent chance that mean of brad one of fertilizer is equal to mean of brad two of fertilizer so that's the last that in this type of two sample t test what we need to adopt a NAR hypothesis thank you for watching kindly don't forget to give the video a thumb up and also a subscription so that you not miss out any of my future content like this also you can contact me through the contact in the description page for more explanation about these concepts thank you